The President of the Defense and Police Officers Wise Association, DEPOA, Mrs. Ogogo Musa, has stressed the need for women empowerment in nation building. Mrs. Musa made their session during an interview with newsmen to mark the 2024 International Women's Day celebration, which was themed Invest in Women, Accelerated Diversity and Empowerment of Women, under the campaign banner Inspire Inclusion, organized by DEPOA in Abuja. Let's join Elizabeth Kasham for more. Speaking on the significance of women's empowerment, Mrs. Musa underlined her leadership role in fostering national development and progress through women empowerment. She said it is not only a moral imperative, but also an essential catalyst for societal advancement. Place of um, leadership, because I believe that when women are empowered, they be able to influence their community, their environment, and in extension to the society. And I love it when I see women doing well. I love it when I see women contributing because without them doing this, the children, the home, will not be where it's supposed to be. So also speaking to newsmen, former Minister of Women Affairs, Dame Pauline Talent, urged women to extend their support to men, particularly those serving in the front line. As women, she said, are indispensable in addressing the formidable security challenges confronted by the nation. When women pray, something happens, and their prayers will not go in vain. International Women's Day is a day where we amplify the need of including women in all facets of national development. Without women being at the decision table, we will never get our laws right. So we need more women, just as Mr. President encouraged his wife to be a senator in the Federal Republic three times. We call on all our leaders to support their wives. Keynote speaker at the event, a gender advocate and a politician, Mrs. Jirid Mohamodga, advocates for gender equality to enhance women's participation and inclusion across various spheres of the society. So we need to, as a matter of urgency, change our tactics. We need to move from comfort to deliberate action. To diversify is to invest politically in the health, education, welfare, economy, and social state of the girl child come woman. Now, if you focus on just empowering the woman, you might meet a woman who is emotionally wrecked, a woman who is physically tired. We need to start by investing in our girls. We need to start by giving them the right of education. Because even in schools, they need to start that conversation amongst themselves. The commemoration of the 2024 International Women's Day by DIPOA witnessed a series of engaging activities, including a symposium aimed at fostering dialogue and awareness on issues pertaining women's empowerment and gender diversity. The symposium, attended by a diverse audience comprising of policymakers, stakeholders, and serve as a platform for robust discussion on strategies that will assist in championing the cause of women empowerment to create an environment environment conducive to the realization of full women potential. Elizabeth Kasham, ASO Television News.